Hey friends, Gator Mom here. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having an awesome day. Today I have a review and packing video on the Dagny Dover Land and Carry All. This here is the small size in Heather Gray. All right, so I know a lot of you have been waiting for this bag for me to review for a couple of months now. I've had it since the end of last year and I've been sharing bits and pieces of it here and there, but this is a perfect, perfect bag for day trips out with just me or if I just maybe have one kid or if I'm not needing to carry a lot for the kiddos. It is on the smaller size. It is the Dagny Dover Land and Carry All in small. So they have this exact bag in the same setup in a medium as well as a large size. Um, they might even have one other size of this bag. I'm not for sure. So definitely if this is a style that you like but you need it larger for say like more kiddos or whatever your packing needs are, travel needs, Needs, they have this bag in a larger size. So today's video also is a team up with my sweet friend Jen who is Perpetual Mommy here on YouTube. She has a ton of awesome bag reviews. Her channel is a lot like mine, really detailed and thorough reviews and packing videos. So definitely head over to her channel and check out her review on this same um, bag. She has a really pretty color. I'm not sure what it's called, but she's going to have a full review and packing video on this one as well. So make sure you check it out whenever you're done seeing this one here. So the carry-all bag comes with a optional messenger or shoulder bag. I have it attached here. It just has two rings here at the very, very top for you to attach the strap. I tend to always carry this bag crossbody or I will carry it just on the crook of my arm. The straps here are nice and short. I can almost get them over my shoulder, but if I have the bag kind of fully packed like this, it doesn't quite go over my shoulder. But on the outside of the bag, you just have the Dagny Dover logo here. No pockets or anything on the front. On the side of the bag, you don't have any pockets or anything. It does snap closed here. So if you want a more kind of slimmer or smaller profile on the bag, you can have these snapped here on the side. If you need a little bit more room, you can of course unsnap them and it adds like a couple of inches here at the top. So I always tend to have mine um, snapped closed. Then on the back of the bag here, the only exterior pocket is this little slit pocket for your cell phone. And it fits mine perfectly. I have an iPhone X with this loopy case here and I can put mine in and out really easy. I think the larger like plus sizes um, might fit as well, but I don't have those to compare. But that's my phone in there. I use this pocket all of the time. It goes down pretty deep too. I wanna say all the way to the bottom here. So now I'm kind of jumping in to the middle of the bag. Something that I want to make sure that I touch on, which is one of my favorites of this bag, are the big chunky zippers. I love the material and how smooth the zippers are. I think I'm actually going to go ahead and unsnap the sides here just to give a little bit easier of a view of the inside. But this is how I have mine all packed up. It's so awesome. There's tons of pockets. You have a zip pocket here, two pockets on the side, and then another long pocket here in the back. I think I'm going to set the camera up just a little bit to give you a better ver um, bird's eye view. All right. I think that's a little bit better of an angle for you guys to really see the organization of this bag. Like I was saying before, you have two awesome pockets here on the side, a long pocket back here in the back and a zip pocket. So I'm gonna go ahead and take out what's on the inside and then go around on the outside pockets. I have back here in the back my planner supplies. I have the um, Simplify Planner Weekly Edition um, with a stretchy band here and a notebook. And then I also have right behind there a small Lily J packing case in the color navy. I think this combo is just absolutely perfect for me on the go. I have just enough pens here and my stickers and whatever I need for my planner if I want to stop while I'm out somewhere and plan and it's not too bulky. It's just nice and streamlined and I have that right there inside the bag. Then in front of it, I have one pouch. This here is a um, Dagny Dover pouch. I'm not sure of the name of this pouch. I will link it below for sure for you guys, but this is an awesome little pouch. It's kind of very similar to the style of this bag as far as it having a snap here on the side. You don't have any exterior zippers or anything like that, but you do have this little hook here if you wanted to attach something to it. But when you open up the pouch, it is so darling. You have a little kind of um, pocket here on the back of the pouch, which I just have small things like hair ties and a nail file and whatnot. Then you have a couple of little loops attached here and I have a chapstick and some eye drops. 
Then on the back here, you have a Velcro spot for a small little tiny zipper pouch that comes inside this bag. And in this zipper pouch, I just have small things, mainly medical stuff like um, tweezers and on the go like travel scissors, band-aids, like just that kind of stuff. A couple of my vitamin C packs, so all of that. Um, is tucked down inside this little zipper so it doesn't get lost inside here. Then I have a bunch of just little things that I would need, like some gum, a granola bar, my um, peppermint stick. I also have my pill case and a mirror. So you guys get the drift. It's like a small essential case, but this one is so much fun. And again, I believe this comes in two or three different sizes. This is the um, smaller one and it fits perfectly inside this carry-all. So that's everything in the main bulk of the bag here, as you can see. In this front zipper pocket here, I just have a package of wet ones if I ever need them. I don't know, it's like the mom in me, I always have them on me. <laughs> and then in these two side zipper pockets, I have some tissues, a hand cream, and a hand sanitizer. Then in that other side pocket over here, I have my eyeglasses and my case. And then attached to the key leash that's on the inside here of the bag, I just have my keys. There is a pouch that comes with this bag. I'm actually not using it at the moment because I decided to use that other cosmetic bag. But this here is the actual pouch that comes with your carry-all. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe the larger um, carry-all bags might even come with multiple pouches. I'm not real sure because um, this is my only thing of this brand that I've ever purchased before. So this is like the pouch that comes with it and you can easily use the little stretchy band that's inside here to attach to the pouch so that you can get your things in and out of the bag really easily. So then on this back pocket here, the only thing left that I have is my large 31 All About the Benjamins wallet and that is just tucked back here in this pocket and it fits great. So that's everything I have inside this bag. I'll give you guys one more look of it so you can really see um, how much space it has. I love it. I carry this bag all the time. It tends to be one that I grab for um, off and on, like when I don't have the kids or, you know, like I said, if they have their own backpacks or whatever at the time. I love the material. It's really forgiving and it's really comfy. So I definitely would recommend this brand and I want to for sure get a backpack and a couple of other things um, since I like this one so much. So I wanna thank Jen for teaming up with me. I can't wait to see how you have yours packed up. Um, like I said, I love the color of her bag. I'm not sure if it's discontinued, but that would be a really pretty backpack. So. I'm gonna check it out for sure. So if you guys have any questions or comments on this particular bag, feel free to leave them below. I will have um, a link for all of the stuff in the description box so that you can easily um, find it. So yeah, I will talk to you on my next video. I hope you have a great day.